Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. All right Cancer, so let's see what's going on for you. How is Cancer coming to the reading? Okay, some of you could be dealing with somebody who's a fraud, a liar. Um, everything they say is a lie. Uh, this could be you or let's see how is cheating while someone's pregnant and don't talk to me anymore. Um, but then missing someone's missing or missing in action or missing you. That is some real tough, heavy drama. Let's see how your person is coming to the reading or the person of interest. Uh, they feel safe with you. Okay, or they know that you feel safe with them. How is Cancer's person promises? Um, if it sounds like a lie, they it probably is. Um, somebody knows that maybe you're lying, or there's an air of deception here. Divorcing coming out. Maybe you guys are going your separate ways. Maybe somebody straight up stalking you. This is not today. Um, okay, let me see. Some of your healing connections, okay? You've had reconciliation or reunion, and you're kind of both letting the baggage go, you know, just kind of letting things go and um, coming back together trying to get on the right path maybe even getting your chakras in alignment like some of you just were out of alignment it could even be in terms of your health and well-being physical health and well-being mental or emotional and uh maybe for your partner it was different but it's about getting back into alignment uh, so that something uh, beautiful miraculous can happen for you and this relationship Let's see. All right. So this card, yeah, cancer. So it's like, yeah, getting back in control. Okay. Um, self, self-directed control. Um, definitely determined to achieve goals. Um, you set some short-term goals and you're really trying to smash them here. This could even be needing, this could even be exercise or needing to get back into exercise and maybe um, go to the gym here. Again, um, focus, a, a, a really direct focus on you. The full card, yeah, exercise, something new developing between you and someone else. Yeah, you've had reconciliation, maybe with an uh, Aries, someone who has Aries, highly aspected, Aquarius, um, maybe even a Cancer like yourself. Um, it just seems as if now you're you're in a place of feeling like um, you've gotten this person back and you need to do something big or you need to make some big move with each other or, or you're trying to move or it could be a physical move with one another with the three of cups here. Let's see what else is going on. Yeah, two of pentacles, but weighing up the cost, maybe even saving money, looking at um, the profit and the loss of Maybe even looking at has someone changed, especially if this is a re reconciliation. Yeah, waiting, waiting to get clarity here. Five of Pentacles about this relationship. Is it because there's still lack of confidence of it, it, it turning into the Ten of Pentacles type of relationship, but you feel like this is your person, the Sun card. You feel like this is the one. Um, yeah, page of pentacles. You feel, Some of you just need to get into better health. This is health and vitality. Um, some of you have been in the dumps. Some of you have been in the dumps by way of overindulging, maybe drinking, social activity. You need to have balance in whatever it is you're doing because it's affecting your physical body and maybe even your mental or emotional health. Yeah, you need to go into some, you know, self-reflection with the eight of pentacles, maybe working too hard or working too much or trying hard to meet new people or uh, with the eight of pentacles doing something over and over again, keeping your head down, but not taking care of you. 
you know, six of cups, but it's like you want to get back to a simpler time with a particular person. So like you get two things going on here. Two of Pentacles, a lot is going on in your life, in your personal life and in your maybe professional business life here. It's like you're trying to weigh everything up. You know that you need to take care of your health and well-being. You know, if you have children, you need to take care of your child or children. Um, and then in your personal and then in your professional life, um, maybe things you, you have to uh, you are the person, uh, the go to person. You have to move things forward. You have you have some goals that you're trying to actually smash. You know, you have something that you're trying to do. You also could be moving or trying to save up for a move. Or it says that you're on the right path in terms of doing whatever it is you're doing. You're getting success and recognition in your business life also. But it's like you're really trying to balance things out. You haven't really taken time to really put 100% behind, okay, I'm going to focus on my health and my well-being, exercise and eating right. And then I'm going to focus on career and finance. It's like you're really just dividing yourself and others would look at this as a stressful time, but it's like you've gotten in the in the groove of it, in the rhythm of it, of it all. Like you you just know how to balance it all out. But you know how to juggle it says the 2 of pentacles. I don't know if there's balance you know how to keep it up, but things are falling by the wayside or you could, you know, yeah, maybe your health. You need to think about the plans for the future and what they look like. You need to really get serious about um, maybe resting, going on vacation, taking a break. Doesn't have to be, you know, long, but you need to take a break here. Um, so this is what I have for you, Cancer. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also don't you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy L a coffee link. You can um what else can you do? Get your own personal reading. Yeah, the website. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yeah. All right, so uh I was about to say Aquarius. So are some of you guys dating that an Aquarius? That card kept wanting to show up for you off camera though. It's like you gotta get things back. And the Aquarius card, the star card talks about alignment. Like some things in your life are just out of alignment. You know, you're all over the place and you need to get back into focus. All right. That's what I have for you. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Um Let's put some veggies down in it because like something needs to be healthy. You need to get more healthy. So if you know that you need to get on your health kick, let's put some veggies down in the comment section. All right. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you.